and now I am in a big hurry. <laughs> okay, okay, then I'll tell you. See, uh, my son is a big fan of yours, too. And his mother used to sing Stormy Weather when he was a baby. Uh, don't know why there had no sun up in the sky. I remember the song. See? <laughs> Stormy Weather. Well, now the only time he hears her singing is in his dreams because she passed away. Oh, I am sorry. Well, why didn't you bring him with you to see me? Well, ever since, ever since that happened, little Lamont hadn't been the same. <laughs> well, what's wrong with him? What's wrong with him? Uh, well, what's wrong is, uh, I don't know where to start. Well, doesn't he go to school? Not anymore. He's a drop-in. <laughs> you mean he's a drop-out? No, drop-in. He dropped in a few times and then just quit. Well, tell me, why is he so interested in me? Well, like I said, see, his mother used to sing Stormy Weather to him, and the only other person could sing Stormy Weather like his mother is you. So I guess he sort of looks on you like a substitute mother. Me? Yeah. And this morning, when, you know, when he woke up, he looked up at me with those big brown eyes, and he said, Daddy, you gonna see Lena Horn today? He said, that's so cute. <laughs> he said, well, if, if you see her, would you tell her I love her? Oh. <laughs> what a shame that you couldn't have brought him here with you. Well, Rita, I can't, uh... Well, can't you bring him here with you? No, he's, uh, I can't explain this. He's not lame, is he? Lame? Yeah, that's what he is, lame. Oh, I am sorry. I'm sorry. You think he'd like my picture? Oh, that'd be so nice. Here's one already signed. Oh, this is really nice. It, is it it's gonna really help? See, in the morning when little Lamont wakes up, I can hold his picture on the other side of the room and he can crawl out to bed to it. <laughs> well, I, I do have to be getting back well, to I'm the leaving. rehearsal. Uh, <laughs> thank you very much for coming by, Mr. Uh... Uh, Sanford. That's uh, S-A-N-F-O-R-D, period. Mr. Sanford, yeah. nice to meet you. Thank you so much. Oh, listen. Tell little Lamont I said hello. Yeah, and there's one other thing I promised him that I would ask you. Yeah? I couldn't. Oh, but what is it? I can't. Well, all right. Goodbye now. Yes, I can. <laughs> See, this morning, little Lamont uh, sat up in the bed and said, Daddy, can you bring me in the horn to see me? <laughs> oh, that's impossible. I, I just can't do it. Well, 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 you I, understand that. Yeah, I understand. Big star like you got a lot more important thing to do than visit little lame boys. <laughs> Mr. Sanford, that's not what it is. Well, look, first of all, I've got to do this show. Then I'm going to do a benefit for Operation Head Start up in San Francisco. So that means I've got to get right to the airport immediately. Airport? Well, my place is right out near the airport. In fact, <laughs> we're so close, when the planes fly over, we can see what movie's playing. <laughs> I'm sorry, I just don't, I can't manage it. As it is, I'm gonna be in a terrible hurry. Well, I promised little Lamont that I would give you the message. So I'm giving you the message. Uh, Miss Horn, Lamont Sanford loves you. Little, little lame Lamont. <laughs> oh, wait a minute. I'll come to your house. I'll you, come. You yes. will? I yes. mean, you're not kidding me. You're not just saying this. No, but now listen, only for a minute. Just put your address right here. I'll try to get there about 8 o'clock. Will little Lamont still be awake? Yeah, if you're coming over, I see to it that he is. Now, you're not just saying this. Now, if you break your promise, you'll break his heart. No, I promise. Well, thank you so much, and thank you for the picture, and, and you, thank you for saving my little boy. Uh, I really appreciate it. <laughs>